Oh, hello. Welcome to the Glenful Breaks. Here we have a wonderful ravine. This is full of water because of all the water that flows from the top of the Glenful Breaks all the way down. There are some beautiful scenery pieces here within the Glenful Breaks. I feel like an artist has sculpted this world. Welcome back. We have some fine craftsmans craftsmanship that uh, some little people, locals, have created for us out of two logs and a wooden board. This is also one of the many viewpoints of the Glenifer Brace. If you look behind us, you can see plenty of mountainside, a dam, houses which wouldn't have actually been here a hundred years ago, and the town of Paisley. It is an absolute beautiful treasure and I believe everybody should come and participate in this walk. My hello there. You caught me as I looked through the trees. I can see the view that my my counterpart John was explaining earlier, but something even more amazing has happened. I have discovered these steps have been carved into the mountain using the mantle of the human flesh. They have made steps out of the sheer mud and wood from the forest. It is simply marvellous. Cops up, it's summer in Scotland! All right, mate. Ah. What's happening? No much. Fucking, what do you mean no much, man? It's a fucking gallus day, man. Aye, well, it's a perfect day for sitting and doing fuck all. Yeah, we're well, fucking doing fuck all. Just sitting, sitting on a fucking bench. Ode in memory of Cameron Ferguson. Thank legend. Thank you very much, Cameron. Absolute legend, mate. I know, put fucking this... Fucking amazing spot, mate. Put this bench here so that stupid cunts like us can come on and sit on it. We're no stupid. We're fucking intellectual bastards. Fucking know what I'm saying, man. <laughs> fucking midges are attacking oh, my face. Fuck you, everywhere, man. <laughs> I'm getting to my cat and everything, man. I'm getting. <laughs> There's about 42 in the morning, mate. I'm fucking getting sick of it, mate. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, that was the bit up there when John was in the rock hole. And now the bottom is so aggressive, it's coming down between the rocks with the thunder of a thousand water guns. Nothing's going to stop it. So you've done your wee walk, walked quite a bit, you had a seat, you had a fag up there, right? Um, you get down to here next to the waterfront, nice wee spot. And uh, most of the stuff is like muddy and shit, so it is an effort to get down here, right? It is a proper effort and you're fucked. And then when you get down here, everything's covered the moss, so you can't lean on anything. But then you come down to this perfect wee bit where it's stony, not muddy, so you can stand on it. And then you've got this bit of rock with no moss in it, that fits right in your fucking arse cheek. Then you can have a fag. It's beautiful. It's a kind of Tana Hill well. It is some of the freshest water you can get up here. I mean look, it's almost like sand that's collected inside this. It's beautiful sand. But it's so clean you can wash your hands in it. Nice and cleanly, as always, because water is clean. And so at the end of your breathtaking walk through the Grays and Paisley. We come to this little bit when you decide to go home, we meet up. There's a lovely view of a pond, and there's a duck right over there. There's another one. Oh no, sorry, that's an empty bottle of wine brew. Uh, just edit that out, okay? 
but as you can see there is a small stream very small stream flowing just under this wooden bridge and people will stop here and flick a penny in just for luck well they have nothing compared to me i am a desperate man so i have to throw in a two pence that is all i have left in my life uh, i can't even have a penny so please please pray in the lord <laughs> Stop the camera! <laughs> dig, dig, dig. I must dig. Every day I dig. Maybe deeper, maybe not. Digging fun, but it's also dangerous. Digging hard, but can be easy. I like digging. My father dug. My grandfather dug. My aunt dug. They all dead now. All got a grave here. Lots of gyms too. Methinks Jim will be popular with the ladies. Only reason to name son Jim. No matter, digging time. I dig, you dig, we all dig. Digging amazing, right? I've been digging since four years old. Been digging for a long time. My time under grave be coming. My son will take my job. My son not Jim, he not good with ladies. Most ladies dead anyway, or gone to Gord Castle or whatever. They not here yet, nobody to put in graves. Still gonna dig them all now. Digging is fun, also hard and dangerous. Dig, dig, dig. A fucking big ass tree. I know. Fucking up, mate. Ah, fuck. Speak it. This will hurt my toe. You actually hurt your toe? Oh. I fucking told you up the arse. Fucking money. What? What? You fucking. These any your fish? Right, where the fuck are you going? Where the fuck are you actually going? Whoa! Ah. <laughs> I echoed the <like> fuck. <laughs> How did you get the blood from me? I don't know. Fucking muddy ass, fucking fast man. This is what you have to deal with when you go here. Fucking pork munch. Oh, yeah, dick. <laughs> How you, yeah, dick? How you, yeah, fucking malapa? Malapa? Is that bridge? Oh. Oh, Munter's face. Ah, <laughs> you nearly went in your ass. <laughs> I don't manage to do it filming you at the same time, you dick. Where are you going? Yeah, fucking pussy. It's not that bad. In fact, that's muddy. I'm going up here. Fucking midges, man. Seriously. Fuck off. They're just getting fucking trampled as soon as they land on me, so I don't know. Send a message out to your pals and go, don't come here. These are getting muddled. It's a bloodbath. Mm -hmm. It's a certain death. Only come here if you've got a death wish. But no, they're not that smart. They don't have mobile phones. That's why humans are the dominant race in this planet.